Just a small amount of water can turn dangerous for drivers. Last night's flooding caused multiple vehicles to stall on flooded streets as we've been talking about through Tulsa. Well, Two Works View's Ashley Wheeler is live at North Lewis and Independence with the dangers of driving through that deep water. Ashley. First responders say most people underestimate the amount of water in the road, especially in dips like you see in this road here, endangering not only themselves, but the people in the vehicle with them. Severe storms swept through Green Country Tuesday, causing major flooding in several areas. When storms come into Oklahoma, they, they typically come in and pack a pretty big punch. Captain Matt Bell is a swift water rescue instructor and says, unfortunately, when there's a torrential rainfall, he sees the same thing every year. Someone will try to go through the water and stall out. And we have other cars coming in behind that will stall out as well. Um, so we end up finding four or five cars stalled. Uh, in the middle of the roadway. Some of them are floating off with people in them. Bell says the water is unpredictable and potentially life threatening. The water could be rising or going down. Uh, there's a lot of hazards in the water. Manhole covers will actually float up. And so there's a, a raging river underneath your feet and you have no clue. It doesn't take much water to cause some potentially dangerous situations. Just one foot of water can take this car off the road and two feet of water will keep most vehicles from getting through. Another issue first responders face is vehicles driving around barricades. You may think, oh, I can still see the roadway. We put them there because it's either shallow, fast moving water or it's deep water, but the barricades are there to save your life. It takes you an extra five or 10 minutes to get home. Don't risk ruining your vehicle or possibly drowning. The main thing to remember is that when these roads are blocked off, they are like that for a reason. The best thing is just to turn around and find another way to get to your destination. Reporting live in Tulsa, Ashley Wheeler, Two Works For You.